I prefer them to not even show up at all, go to greener pasture somewhere else. North County neighbors afraid of what's moving in next door. New at 7, 10 News reporter Joe Little took their concerns to the owners of a new mental health care facility. A Fallbrook resident called 10 News to say he's really concerned about what's going to happen here to the old Fallbrook Hospital. He's not worried about the building, he's worried about the people who could be moving in. It's been two years since Fallbrook Hospital cared for patients. Definitely disappointed. Tracy Schwant says it was one of the many reasons she and her husband moved to the North County. You know, they have this really happy image of our small community. They're not happy anymore. Tracy's husband contacted 10 News about the hospital's new owners, Crestwood Behavioral Health. The hospital is slated to become the Fallbrook Healing Center. It will treat roughly 100 people with mental health issues. Tracy fears the patients will be criminals, sexual predators, and they won't even be from San Diego County. I think most of Fallbrook is unaware. She says safety is their biggest concern, especially since Crestwood says patients will eventually be released when they're ready. It's very scary. Fallbrook's most vulnerable is within walking distance. I spoke with Crestwood's Sacramento-based spokesman. Larry Kamer says the vast majority of the patients will be from San Diego County. None will be violent criminals, and he says they'll only accept patients recommended by the county. If not here, then where? Well, I have compassion. Compassion for her community and to get people help, just not in her backyard. I prefer them to not even show up at all, go to greener pasture somewhere else. In Fallbrook, Joe Little. I don't want them in here at all. 10 News. There is a public meeting next Wednesday with the Fallbrook Health District. Tracy says she expects a lot of people to show up to voice their concerns too. A 10 News viewer, as we said, tipped us off to this story. If you have a story you'd like us to check out, just email tips at 10news.com.